For now, Rosemont Acacia Park slumbers under the cover of a blanket of snow. But will there be a spring for this green space on Detroit's northwest side? At this moment, Trina Tucker says no. Unfortunately, this beautiful park will be closed, which means will be the gates will be closed. It will no longer be cut. The children will not have access to the park. It's one of 50 parks that will be closed to save the city more than $6 million. Mayor Dave Bing announced the plan within days of city council's refusal to vote on the lease deal with the state for Belle Isle. We don't have the staff. We don't have the equipment anymore to maintain these parks. Tucker oversees the city's Adopt a Park program. Rosemont Acacia sits right on the border of two of the five neighborhoods that make up Grandmont Rosedale. If kids are to use the playscape this spring, it will be because people who care step in to help. Among other things, the Grandmont Rosedale Development Corporation buys up foreclosed homes, refurbishes them, and then resells them, all to keep this neighborhood strong and vibrant. The organization plans to take action to make sure the park stays open as well. It's an asset now, we want to keep it that way, and we certainly don't want to see it become a liability. The community is already invested in the park, coming up with the money to buy the benches and the playground equipment. I know that there's already been discussions about raising money to do the grass cutting that needs to be done, and then there's already uh, ongoing efforts to bring volunteers there to pick up litter. And I would hope this community would you know step up and volunteer adopt it i'm willing able to sign off on it for adoption spring will come at least at this park dave llewellyn seven action news